Well, it may be a good time for you to take the kids out of the room. This may be a subject matter that you may not feel comfortable with them hearing. So there's a new, uh, there's a new way to help with erectile dysfunction. It doesn't involve a solution to the symptom. It involves a solution to the problem. And this is what I love. Dr. Goldstein is here uh, from San Diego Sexual Medicine Alvarado Hospital talking about more. You're going to start the FDA. You're going you're gonna to start the whole thing with the FDA trial. The first FDA trial. The, the, the project, this is uh, 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 um, shockwave therapy. So okay. shockwaves are. That sounds like it hurts. Uh, absolute pain free. Shockwaves <laughs> are, are uh, waves that travel greater than the speed of sound, mm -hmm. like a sonic boom. Uh, they have the the companies that have made the shockwave therapy uh, um, have an energy that releases just near the surface, and it doesn't cause injury to the tissue, but it causes like a gentle inflammation. Mm -hmm. The cells of the body f uh, appreciate the inflammation, and stem cells come into the tissue that wouldn't normally be there. That would normally be there. Do they stay there? And they stay there. So uh, is that the problem with erectile dysfunction in the first place? Okay, so erectile dysfunction is extremely common. I have this Okay, uh, I'm going to hold it here. here. Thank right, you. I appreciate the, it. Which camera? Oh, which Okay, wait, here we go. Now this is what? So these are rods that represent a hardness. So this would be the hardness of okay. a normal, normal function and okay. this would be less hard but mild off. Okay. This would be more moderate and this okay. would be more severe. Gotcha. 52% of men have these versions of really? erectile dysfunction age 40 to 70. So it's actually pretty common to have this problem. Um, and the effect that it has on their lives. It's horrible. It's devastating. It's demoralizing. Self-esteem goes down. You can't keep relationships, divorces. It's a big deal. Yeah, there's a, a lot of and second and third order and fifth and sixth problems issue. that comes. Yeah, it's like a domino effect of problems right. from this one issue. So there, the, everything that we've had so far is a solution to the symptom. Yes, yeah, the symptom. But, so uh, for the time being, you could take a drug, increase the blood flow, it works, but then when the drug goes away, you're back the way you once were. But you know what? There's, I guess my question is, there's a lot of symptoms um, that come from much bigger problems, like heart problems. And I understand Correct. that erectile dysfunction is, is a symptom of a heart, you know, heart problem sometimes. You are bang on with this. So yeah. what, what if you, I mean, you take this and then you cure this organ, but the other organ is really, I mean, that was, that was the organ that was supposed to tell you that something was wrong with the other organ that, you know, can't, you know, doesn't have a voice. You know what I mean? Yeah, so, so how do you um, do that? Uh, we can't stop the process of aging. Yeah. But what we can do is make the tissue in the organ much more healthy okay. so that either it's more spontaneous or a treatment like a, a Viagra type of medication which didn't work will now work. You know so what, it's pretty, pretty exciting. You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of the um, magnetic therapy. And, it, um, it, you know, the, mag the magnet. Sure, and provides then, an energy. Yeah. yeah, and then the, you know, the waves and all this. You know, I think science is, is, and, and medicine are hand in hand these days, don't you think? It's absolutely amazing. This has zero side effects because we've done it in animals and we've done it already in humans in Europe. So we're taking the information from Europe and this is the first FDA approved trial. In America. In America. We have 23 patients and you're at Alvarado it. Hospital. You're the one, right. again. So very exciting. <laughs> and then, assuming the study goes well and the data shows what it showed in Europe, we'll open to eight centers in the United States. What did it show in Europe? So statistical improvement in function, uh, uh, sliding up the scale by one point. So if you okay. were really? a four, you were a three. If you were a three, you are two. How do yeah. people get into your study? So we have a seminar tonight on purpose related to this show. So okay. at six o'clock tonight, we have a seminar. We've been advertising on on radio and in print okay. uh, to uh, explain the, this trial to people and see who would be interested in coming. It's very exciting. It's at six o'clock tonight at Alvarado, and we would love to offer people a better chance to actually help their bodies as opposed to just symptomatically treat it. I have so many more questions for you. <laughs> the next time, we got to send it back over to Erica, but the next time you come in, can we, I know you're not a psychologist or, or Raul, uh, I know you're not a psychologist, but um, I want to talk about how to talk to your partner when oh, they may be in denial. Fabulous. Yeah, can we talk about that next yeah, time? Yeah, and I'll bring Dr. Hartzell. She's Ooh, fabulous perfect. with that. Yeah. Absolutely. Thank you for being here. <laughs> thank you so much for doing this. Uh, you know, thank you for doing this. <laughs> it's spreading joy all around the world. Raul, we're going to send it outside with you.